Hello everyone, Dusty Flagger here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can connect your Beats or AirPods products to your Steam Deck, and how you can control the noise cancelling. Alright, first step you're going to want to do is be on the home screen, then press the Steam button, go down to power, and then press switch to desktop. Alright, now that I'm on the desktop, what you're going to want to do is open up a browser of your choice, for example, I'm going to be using Firefox. And then you want to press Steam plus X, and that will open it up, and then you can go ahead and search for Decky. Decky Loader. Remember you press Steam plus X to open the keyboard if you don't find it. And just this one. Go ahead and press download. Right click that and then you want to drag it onto your desktop. And it might ask you, let me move my camera. Might ask you if you want to move it, press move. And you can go ahead and double click that. Continue. It might ask for you for a password if you've put an administrative password on your Steam Deck. You have not appeared to have set admin password. Yes. Release. So, there's still a few more steps we need to do, but this is basically just installing a deck loader onto our Steam Deck. Installed. Alright, the next step we're going to want to do is press return to gaming mode. Alright, now that we are in the normal environment, or Steam, you can go ahead and press the three dot button, and you'll see here we have a new setting, Decky. And we can go ahead and press the marketplace icon up there and we can search for a tool called i believe it's called magic pods so we go down to m magic pods here we go and monitor the battery level of your airpods and beats easily switch between noise cancellation modes install install so go ahead and press that and it will install a new plugin just like that if we go down to the three dots we see it and I'm going to pair headphones. And to do this, you can go into the settings, Bluetooth, then go add device. Let me turn my, I'm going to be using Beat Studio Buds. Ah, uh, not Buds, Pro. Got them on Black Friday last year. Let's see, will it connect or will it glitch? All right, turns out I needed to hold the pairing button or the system button for three seconds. All right, it's connected, as you can see there. But now if we go down to the Magic Pods, plugin as you can see there we can go ahead and control the noise cancellation we can do all of these really handy features this is really nice like really useful upgrade and i would really recommend installing this if you have beats or airpods and plan on using them in the if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and subscribe it really helps thanks for watching